Basically, my mother was on her way back home. She was in jo she was working in Johannesburg, right? Okay. I was staying with my father and my siblings in Durban, oh. and something had happened. It was like a little incident with my sister, um, her daughter, so she had to rush back home um, that that weekend. But because she was so worried, she wanted to come back a little earlier, like on a Wednesday. And as she was rushing back, she just happened to be at the wrong place at the wrong time in the wrong taxi. And there was like a taxi rivalry thing going on, and she just, it was unfortunate. And I was trying to get to the vet like a pill does. You know, intentions are good enough with the three of us. It's real, girl. Come here. People didn't receive it the way I wanted them to receive it. You know, I expected something way bigger. I thought it was gonna break me out of where I was staying, but that didn't happen. And so, like coming out of that, and that like inspired me to make that song. That's why that song is like so personal, but at the same time, it's like people can dance to it and they love. It.
hidden if you don't realize that Nasty C is coming for your shit. Nasty C, like I said, is the is the biggest thing now. You can build a Justin Bieber of Africa out of him. He's young, the talent is there. I feel like it was a smart decision on my behalf. And it's something that I really don't regret because I actually brought myself closer to people that are well driven and people that know business, you know, in all shape and form. So for me it's not even about like a record deal and to come and join with the other artists or whatever. I mean, it's purely based on the fact that Reggie understands business and he's also in touch with the music side of it. So he knows what to do, when to do it, how to do it, you know, and with who to do it, you know. So for me to join a stable like that, obviously it's, it's, it's home also because the people that are here are actually cool. And this jacket looks good on me. I want to thank God, man. Without God, none of this would be happening right now. None of this would be possible. And I want to make a special shout out and actually call on Reggie. Reggie to the stage. If Reggie can come on stage, please. Reggie, Reggie, Reggie. Where's Reggie? I thank you very much. This means a lot. Nasty C. We're building a superstar here that will represent us in the whole world. We must be ashamed of South Africa that till today we have never produced a superstar in the whole world. And this is what Mabala Noise is doing. We are owing for it and we are not going to stop. Hashtag we are not yet done. Um, I thought I would be more excited to get this. Uh, if you know my raps, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, shout out to all the kids that never get on radio, that can't get their song played on radio because they don't have enough money. Shout out to all the kids who put out music videos, that never get their music videos played on TV because they don't have the money. There's a lot of people that struggle to put music out in this country and I feel like there's too many structures that are blocking people from putting out the dopest music. 90% 90% of the shit I hear on radio is garbage The stuff is living on the internet Everything is living on the internet right now So if you're a kid And you're watching this right now Forget radio If they don't let you play on radio You better go to the internet And make your songs pop on the internet hey. Yeah, they cut me off I don't understand why they cut me off I was actually about to like say something nice But now like I'm feeling aggressive now So whatever, whatever I say is going to be aggressive You know? the gram holding money to your ear there's a disconnect we don't pull that money over here yeah first of all let me get one thing clear i do not sound like david get the f out of here first of all let me get one thing clear i do not sound like david get the out of here. David is nasty. See, see, see.